and you found out your unborn child had a serious medical problem. One woman's baby was diagnosed with a serious heart condition while still in the womb. As health specialist Irene Mayer shows us, a new approach combining obstetrics and pediatrics allowed doctors to save the baby's life. Born for a routine checkup, Christina Glenn may never... And I went for my normal checkup, my routine checkup, and um, the baby's heartbeat was 300 a minute. The heart rate of a normal fetus is between 120 and 160 beats per minute. Well, this is uh, at least a doubling of the heart rate, and this leads the heart to suffer uh, and to enlarge, and eventually can lead to death from heart failure. Christina was diagnosed with a rare heart condition called ventricular tachycardia. Not long ago, doctors would have had to wait for birth before treating it. But now, a specialized team of doctors at Tampa Children's Hospital at St. Joseph's can treat the fetus while it's in the womb. We can begin to look at problems that we've been very good at treating over the last 20 years in babies and children and apply the same standard, the same principle to our babies before birth. I think you look like the daddy. Christina was given medication to slow her heart rate, but in order to be effective, the mother had to endure a very high dose of medication. We can give medicines to the mother, and through her circulation, the medicine will pass through the placenta to the baby. Baby Christina will continue on medication and be monitored 24 hours a day. It's a major commitment for the Glenn family, but one they're willing to accept. Irene Mayer, News Channel 8. Baby Christina was released from St. Joseph's neonatal intensive care unit today. Doctors believe medication will correct her condition. If not, they will consider surgical options. Isn't that something, though? Yeah, wonderful. Magical. Some rough weather.